Hare Krishna. I just received an email from devotees who put out emails every day. And the title of it is, Will Deaf Wait? And it reminded me of what I'd been thinking about earlier during the day, how without actually experiencing devotional ecstasy and love of God, other factors kick in, negative factors. Fear, guilt, people are driven by that to engage in devotional service. And the title of that email reminded me of that. Just, it was just the minute I saw it, I was, yes, that's preaching on a, on a lower level. Fear, will death wait? That's not the preaching of Lord Chaitanya Sankirtan movement. Preaching of Lord Chaitanya Sankirtan movement is experiencing a higher taste. It's not about liberation. It's about learning to love God again not fear God but love God so devotees fall into this pattern of fear and inciting fear in other people that's why you should love God because but it's not really love. It's fear. And that also goes with guilt. Both these things are used to try to control people. Guilt. How guilty you. Guilt. Fear and guilt. What kind of motivation is that? Fear and guilt. That's not Krishna consciousness. That's not Krishna consciousness. Fear and guilt is not Krishna consciousness. Ecstasy and bliss, that's Krishna consciousness. So when I saw that, headline on the email will death wait no 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 how low sinking so low to just try to scare people put fear in their heart you want to put love in their heart not fear <laughs> by experiencing a higher taste It's, it's like prashadam. If the only preaching is don't eat this and don't eat that and this is no good and you can't have that and this is no good, what will that do? The preaching is here's some nice prashadam. So delicious. That's the preaching. And when the sincere soul, the honest person, tastes the prasadam, they naturally give up taste for other things. Lesser things, unhealthy things, 